interest and your cooperation and your uh, communication. And a good many people told me that they uh, heard about your statement, I guess, on TV, wasn't it? Yes, that's right. Uh, I, I, I've been locked up in this office and I haven't seen it, but I won't tell you how grateful I am and how, uh, how worthy I'm going to try to be of all your hopes. Well, thank you very much. I'm so happy to hear that, and I knew that you had just that great spirit, and you know you have our support and backing. Well, because we know what a difficult period this is. It's a, it's a, just an impossible period. We've got a budget coming up that we got nothing to do with. It's practically already made, and we've got a civil rights bill that hadn't even passed the House, and it's November, and Hubert Humphrey told me yesterday everybody wanted to go home. We've got a tax bill that they haven't touched. And we just... Uh, got to let up, not let up on any of them and keep going, and I guess they'll say that I'm repudiated, but I'm going to ask the Congress Wednesday to just stay there they pass them all. They won't do it, but we'll just keep them there next year till they do, and we just won't give up an inch. Uh -huh. Well, this is, this is mighty fine. I think it's, uh, it's so imperative. I think one of the great uh, tributes that we can pay in memory of President Kennedy is to try to enact some of the great uh, progressive policies that he sought to initiate. Well, I'm going to support them all, and you can count on that, and I'm going to do my best to get other men to do likewise, and I'll have to have y'all's help. I never needed more than I do now. Well, you know you have it, and just feel free to call on us for anything. Thank you so much, Martin. All right. Call me when you're uh, I sure will. Call me when you're down here next time. I certainly will. But let's get together, and, and any suggestions you got, bring them in. Fine. I certainly will do that. Thank you so much. Thank you.